Hi, this is Dee with Divine Needle. Um, man, I hate getting those readings. So, um, this just came to me. And I wanted to share it with you all. Direct hit, space weather woman predicts massive solar storm to strike Earth. Well, <clears throat> this is yesterday, 9.55 p.m. Um... One of the world's leading space science experts predicted a direct hit from a solar storm. Dr. Tamitha Scove, known as the Space Weather Woman, is a research scientist at a federally funded aerospace corporation. <clears throat> um, SpaceX satellite explodes during solar storm. On this little video. Anyway, direct hit, she predicted, a snake-like filament launched as a big solar storm while in the Earth strike zone. NASA predicts impact early July 19th. Strong aurora shows possible with this one, deep into mid-latitudes. She said there could be disruption to GPS and amateur radio. Less than... This might... This video might be about that. Let me look here. I'm not sure. Okay. This is coming our way. Anyway, um... <clears throat> Remember, my prediction was anywhere between now and the 20th, but they were telling me 19th, 20th, depends on what part of the planet you're on. And, um, <clears throat> yeah, that's happening. Um, so, a snake-like filament cartwheeled its way off the sun. And it's saying G2, possibly G3 conditions may occur. Um, <clears throat> there's also um, SpaceX Dragon spacecraft docks with ISS delivering science benefiting humans 16 hours ago. So possibly that reading was about the ISS and not the TSS, or maybe both of them are in jeopardy. I don't know. Anyway, um, the solar storm could cause blackouts and things of that nature. <laughs> Anyway, uh, so my team's dead on again, and my communication with them evidently is um, ramping up even more. I don't know. But um, the fact that there's a current docking going on Right now, I don't know how long they're scheduled to be docked out there. And I don't know if the TSS has any current docking going on or not. 
But, um, yeah, that could be an issue. Anyway, um, my husband's dream about a wave coming. And um, then my reading, um, like I said, my husband's abilities are ramping up, to say the least. So, um, I hope we don't get bad news from the space stations, because that would be um, super sad. It's, um, I suppose at least they're dying doing what they love doing, huh? So that's the um, <clears throat> upside to all that. Um, I'm hoping that what they told me is not true about the space station or stations that might be at risk here. Um, but it's definitely, um, yeah. So I just thought I'd give a heads up that that reading was, um, so far, the, um, it looks like that reading's, um, at least partially coming to pass. So everybody, just uh, heads up, um, you guys could be seeing uh, the aurora. Closer to the equator than normal, for sure. And possible uh, communications issues and blackouts. Anyway, I just thought I'd let you guys know. Um, I do have another video I need to do. It's about that huge download they gave me. And it's about... Um, Well, where we're at and what to expect, okay? Yeah, wow. Anyway, try to have a good day. Hang in there. This is a test, trust me. It's a test. Talk to you guys later.